New at four, it is shaping up to be a big year for the fall bag worm. Trees all over the metro are covered with them. Channel 2's Barrett Peterson is live in Forsyth County, where the infestation is hard to miss there. Barrett? Yeah, look at this. It is kind of creepy looking. This is sort of the house that the caterpillars build around themselves to eat the leaves off of your trees. Heather Collard says what she is about to do may not be for those with sensitive stomachs. They can get pretty grossed out, and they are concerned about the health of the tree. Inside that bag are hundreds of fall web worms. The caterpillars live on leaves, sometimes all the leaves. I have seen some, some younger trees that have been completely engulfed in the webs, and there aren't any leaves left on them. Colich is Forsyth County's agriculture agent. She says the worms appeared much earlier this year, and there seems to be more of them. The mild winter and the drought may have played a role. She says while the pests eat the leaves, they don't eat the buds, so unless your tree is very small or very old, it should be fine. Any of the callers that we have are concerned that the, that the worms are actually killing the tree, but they are not. Just wait. They are nearing the end of their feeding period at this point. They will soon be climbing down the trees. The Nests will become brittle and can more easily be blown or washed down. The college says if you just can't stand the sight of one of these things, you can use a pole or a rake or something, swat it down. If you leave it alone, the caterpillars fall out, they burrow into the ground, they emerge in the spring as moss. One of the wonders of nature. Corey Live in Forsyth County, Barrett Peterson, Channel 2 Action News.